literally how I feel today. And I'm starting to break out. Um, I'm a bit grumpy today, so I do apologise. I hope it's not going to show up. I hope it's not going to show my voice over. I'm going to try and be happy. I'm just a bit grumpy. I think I'm hormonal. Da -da -da -da. <laughs> anyway, today's set of nails is a recreation set of nails plus one of my own. And I do do them slightly differently, but not really. They're, they're all they're quite similar. But um, our Kelly as well done a nail like this as well very recently um our kelly from chronically creative nails so um and i was so we, and i thought ah oh, kelly's done it so maybe i shouldn't do it now but i i just absolutely love this design and i thought i just i'm gonna give it a go because why not i leave the image of the actually i'll put it on the screen now this is the set of nails that i saw i don't know if it's this side or this side but i'll put it there and the name of the lady whose instagram account i saw it on is gonna be down down here because i can't say it <laughs> i think it's one of those names that i'm not even gonna try to pronounce <clears throat> so let's just let's just crack, let's just crack on okay love you righty ho we have got our madame glam gel polishes and these i haven't used these yet so decals that i haven't used yet we're using today little vw uh, the, are they vw beetle i can't remember they're little beetle cars anyway we're gonna use angelic sonata i roll uh the king's speech and lightborn we're gonna use these plus we're gonna use a couple more that i will tell you as we go through pardon me i'm so sorry i've just burped i do this i drink my cherry pepsi max just before i do a voice statement i'm like that's that's just don't do it right i'm applying lightborn to the top and i've cured it for 30 seconds and then i've just done a second coat this yellow is just do this yellow very thin coats because it's prone to wrinkling um it's yellows are a pain in general i'm gonna put the blue we're gonna make like our first little mountain here doesn't have to be too neat right i'm if you need to do two coats, just cure it and go back over it. I was trying to put enough on that I didn't have to do two coats, but don't make it so thick that it wrinkles because it's just not worth it. So if you have to do two thinner coats as opposed to one thicker coat, then I'm just using the purple to create the second... I was going to say rainbow. It's not rainbow. The second mountain. It's a mountain. <laughs> Um, in the background and that will go in the lamp for a cure as well and then we're going to use the peachy i love this color it's so gorgeous to create the, the bottom the bottom bit i am going to put a second coat of this on though and just flatten this bit here because i want to put my little beetle on this on this nail so i need a flat area i decided to use the red colored beetle because i haven't used red in the set and all the other ones, I don't know, I just, I thought this one would, I don't know, I went with the red. I've cut off the excess. You just put it on upside down on your stamper and then just dampen the back. And then after a few seconds, it should just slide off. Maybe more than a few, but less than 20. It's quite quick, quite quick. Um, I'm going to just colour the back in with, this is the Madame Glam's Perfect White Gel Polish. Give it a cure before you pop it on. And it just brightens up the decal because I'm putting it over blue. If I was putting it on a white, it wouldn't matter. But because I put it on a blue, look, we've got a little beetle car. Oh, it's so cute. And then I'm going to a velvet matte top coat at this point. Because we're going to do some sugaring. Make sure the sides are done as well because you don't want little... You don't want light, shiny streaks. Right, I'm using royal pink. I'm going to pop a little bit of that on as well. And you're going to need the angel dust from Nail Sugar. This is now back in stock. I've bought myself a load of it. I love it. Oh, I love it so much. And Karen's sending me some as well, bless her. So I'm going to have so much. <laughs> but what we're going to do is we're going to outline our mountains. So you just want to go around the edge of the mountains with the colour that they are. And then you also want to go around the edge of the, the bottom bit, the, like the ground. We're gonna put we're gonna put more than one line on that. So we're gonna do that one, and then we're gonna do like two more lines going in that same kind of direction, <clears throat> just to to give it the detail, I suppose. And then we're also going to do a pink sun. So this is the royal pink, 
and then don't cure that you want to sprinkle that with your i'm using the angel dust you can use acrylic the angel dust has got the a gorgeous sort of it when the light hits it it's got like an orangey an orangey kind of like shimmery sparkle it's just gorgeous and it just gives this whole set just something extra and i am I'm, I'm all here for it i love it i do so I've, again look but like you do with acrylic you want to make sure that there's no shiny bits before you cure it and then once it's cured you can just wipe off the excess I don't know that you can see it very well. Wait until the end when I show you the close-up and you'll be able to see the, I think you can see the, the shimmer just a bit. It's just got this gorgeous, I don't know, it's just, I don't know if I'm doing it justice here. But it's just got a gorgeous sort of orangey shimmer and it's amazing. Right, this next nail is going to be the cactus nail that she done. I'm going to do mine on an ombre, so I'm using the... Is it King's Speech at the top and then Royal Pink at the bottom? I should be wearing gloves because look, I've got gel polish uncured on my skin. Um, especially with everything that's going around at the moment with allergies and people talking about allergies and stuff. As long as you are using the product properly and you're wearing gloves and keeping yourself protected, you should be fine. There we go. Right, I'm going to do that twice. I've done it twice. I'm going to use El Ray now. This is, I love this colour, so nice. And we're gonna, that's gonna be the colour of our pumpkin. So, not the pumpkin. Did I call it pumpkin earlier? I meant cactus, the cactus now. Did I call it a pumpkin earlier? I probably did. <laughs> uh, anyway, um, I don't know what this name of cactus is. <clears throat> I don't know, or cacti, sorry. I don't know the name of cacti. No, a, a cactus is one, isn't it? And more than one cactus is a cacti. Is it cacti? I don't know. Uh, but anyway, look, this cactus, cactus is going to be one of these funny looking ones. And you, yeah, I'm here. All I'm doing is literally copying the same shape of her cactus. Emma, is that right? Cactus is one. Cacti is lots of them. I don't know. I'm not sure. I'm going to go with that. <laughs> if it's not, I'm sure someone can correct me. Yeah. So we're just going to fill in. Uh, she also had a little one down here. It looks like a cactus with ears, doesn't it? The other one. It looks like it's like a teddy almost with this bit. These look like ears there. This could be the face. <laughs> anyway, cure that in the lamp. Then I'm going to use... I had this is this one's called pink about you right i had the idea was there was method behind my madness but it didn't work out so i was gonna put this behind the lighter pink and then once i poked ho holes in the lighter pink the idea was that you could see the darker pink in the middle of it but it didn't work out like that cured that in the lamp then i'm going to matte top coat you'll see what i mean in a minute <coughs> And then cure that again. And then like we did with our last nail, we're just going to go around the edge of all the different, like all the different sections of cactus. I suppose the last time we went around the edge of the mountains, this time we're going around the edge of the mountains. It's going to take me a while. So I am going to, do I shimmy forward? Do, yeah, look, we're going to move forward. There we go, that's them done. And then again, I'm gonna use the angel dust to sugar this, because the the, sh the angel dust is, you could use diamond dust, but the angel dust is really, really fine. And once it's cured, just tap off the excess. And then, I this is the, this is the lighter pink. So the idea was that I put that on, and then I sugar it. Where have I got, there we go. Look, we're gonna use this again. You'll see what I mean in a minute. And then I take my dotting tool with a very fine edge, very fine end in a minute. And I was hoping that I could poke the hole in and you'd see that darker pink in the middle, but it, it didn't, it didn't work. <laughs> it was a fail, I'm afraid. 
yeah, it just looked like pink. Anyway, I thought, right, I'll just dab a bit more of this angel dust on. Oh, oh, is an ambulance outside? I hope, I hope the person's all right. And then you just, yeah, just dust off the excess once you've cured that. And just to finish off, using Madame Glam's black gel paint, we're just going to add some black dots to the uh, cactus. You can put them on the look, on the edges there as well if you want to. Wherever you think you want them. Same on this little one down here, don't forget that one. And then the gel paints need 60 seconds in an LED lamp. So double time. And then that will be that now finished. I love this one. It looks really nice as well. When you actually see the angel dust shimmering, it just, uh, it, honestly, I can't get over the angel dust. You can save 10% on the angel dust, by the way, using code NATMUG10. It's from Nail Sugar. Don't know if I said that bit, probably didn't. And you can save 30% off Madame Glam using my code NATMUG30. This one, I'm just putting like little layers on. And each time I go in with a different color, I will have cured the previous colour. If I'd have put them on all at the same time, they probably would have like, they probably would have mushed together or something. Um, and also I do give this one two coats as well. They do have two coats. So I've done this blue and I think I go over the orange at the same time, but I don't show you me going over the orange because I just thought there's no point. But I do give this now two coats. And then this lighter green is called Aries Season as well. I forgot to show you the bottle. It's a really pretty green. I like it a lot. Aries Season, that one. That's going to go in the lamp now for 60 seconds. Then at this point, I should have top coated. But <clears throat> I stupidly started to put the cactus on. And this is not the time for the cactus. Because the cactus gets sugared. So the ta the tax... The cactus... <laughs> and put your teeth back in yeah so the the i shouldn't be drawing this on yet i should have top coated first but i am drawing my cactus slightly different to hers i i felt like no no disrespect or anything um i thought hers looked a bit like someone giving you the middle finger because it had like five it had like five i don't know what these are called like cactus arms so i'm just gonna do I'm going to do three. Uh, Kelly also done three. And she did say something about it. And I can't remember what she said about it. But yeah, I, I've never I've never seen cactuses with... Well, I don't live in a hot country in America. In a hot state in America. So I, the only cactuses I see are those little pretty ones with lots of flowers on that you get in garden centres. Do you know the ones I mean? <laughs> anyway, right, look, I'm top coating it now. And I'm going to, like we did with the mountains, I'm just going to go over the top of each of the sections of colour with the corresponding colour. And on those ones, I only put it on the side because I didn't want to, and a little bit there on the green, but because that big cactus was going to get in the way, so I thought, well, I'll just put it on the side. And again, I went with a colour sun, purple, a uh, lilac, sorry, lilac sun on this one as well. And then I'm going to, I'm before I redo the cactus, I'm going to sugar these first. Just so that there's no way that the gel polish colours will touch. Because I didn't want that to happen. So I've cured and now I am brushing off. And then I will start to paint on my cactus again. <laughs> so annoying. But there we go. Uh, I am going to skip forward because you have seen me draw the cactus. But you just literally want to cover the cactus with the gel paint with the gel polish again and then you're going to sugar it with the angel dust and then cure it in a lamp and then dust it off and that is that one it looks so i love the angel dust it's so nice i can't tell you i'm going to do another one i'm going to add my own on now but i do it off camera because you get the gist of how to do them um and i'll show you a close-up Ta-da! I done a sign saying Texas, 44 kilometers, because Texas is a hot place that has cactuses. That was my thinking. <laughs> 
anyway i hope you like this video if you did please leave me a like if you haven't already do consider subscribing i'm gonna leave the lady's instagram link down below so you can go and find her god bless love you all and i will see you beautiful lot in the next one love you bye